Oh, hey, what's going on, gang? I don't like uh, that they're using us to fill their black joke quota all at once. <laughs> I don't like that I'm roasting Samir. He's like the nicest dude in all this. He's ridiculously, he seems, doesn't he seem like the kind of guy that gives his hand a hickey before he rubs one out? <laughs> <laughs> Too nice. <laughs> I feel like I'm at a disadvantage. I mean, look at the way we're dressed. Like lesbian lumberjacks. <laughs> I like Mike, you know? Mike looks like, Mike looks like one of those blue aliens in Avatar. You know what I mean? He looks like Jake Soley if he did blackface, you know? <laughs> You're like, idiot, I mean, if he did blackface. I, um... Samir, if you look on Samir's Facebook, um, you'll find out that he cuts his own hair, which, it, that's not impressive. He's, he's poor. Um, what is impressive is that he cuts his own hair with the same rock he used to circumcise his prom date. <laughs> okay. no. He's too nice! I don't wanna do this. That's pretty good, that's pretty good. Yeah, give it up for the Fresh Prince of Bad Hair. Give it up for him. He looks like he get his braids done at the Dollar Tree by Michael J. Fox, you know, I Google this. <laughs> Fresh Prince, we do look like we're shooting uh, Bad Boy 6 for Tubi. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Samir's a sentimental guy. Whenever he wants to watch um, old reality show reruns, he uh, jogs to the Brookville Zoo naked. <laughs> <laughs> African joke. <laughs> Mike is what white women practice on before they transition to a real black guy. A real BBC. <laughs> no. I, I, I was trying to think of something for BBC, but I, <laughs> it's too many letters. <laughs> no, because I, I told you, I don't want to do this. Like, I feel bad for Samir. But Samir doesn't have a great relationship with his mom. Um, this is true. It all went downhill when he found out Angelina Jolie tried to refund him. <laughs> She's a good mom. She's a good mom. Oh. Mike Knight suffered from... Can I say the N-word? Face, you know what I mean? He looks like Mike Knight suffers from rest my hand on the handwheel, officer face. Okay, all right. He's, he's so fucking cute. Doesn't he look like, like Lego Martin Lawrence? Looks <laughs> 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 like he can star in Amistad on Ice. <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, he's just so, just so oh. fucking adorable and fun size. Like, if he was one of the black guys on that movie Get Out, he would be 30% off. <laughs> Oh, oh, 50%, 50%. Yeah. Buy one, get one free. <laughs> I understand. Oh, here, this is a good one, I think. Mm -hmm. Here we go, here we go, we got it. All right. I understand that Mike always wants to be American black, okay? I understand that, because that's also my dream, you know? Okay, as an African, I always want to be American black. Mike just want to be any black. You know, that's all he wants to be. But him being black, it's like almond milk being milk. It doesn't make sense, does it? All right, that was it. That, that was it. That was the big, big closure for me. Speaking of black, your teeth look like old Bible paper. <laughs> Fucking me. <laughs> yeah, um. 
I I just I, I don't I, Samir he's a fucking nice guy yo he was uh, born in Sudan and uh, uh, raised in Egypt and uh, in America uh, Uber drivers call him the chosen one <laughs> from the prophecy <laughs> been studying his whole life to be a taxi driver. <laughs> <laughs> I know the way. <laughs> oh, okay, all right. Look at me. I am the driver now. I didn't want to do this. I didn't want to do this. I didn't want to do this. All right, all right, all right. I like Mike, you know. Mike and I are very... Mike and I are very similar, you know. He said, I, I am from Sudan, right? Mike, Mike is actually stationed... He was in the military, stationed in Japan. Yeah, give it up for that, right? Right, yeah, hell yeah. You're welcome. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, I, and I was a child soldier in Sudan. Anybody else? I, I, I didn't think so, you know? Cupcakes, cupcake, cupcakes uh, give me PTSD. And Mike, for his, P, for his uh, PTSD, Japanese women, that's, well, that, that's what gives him PTSD. Japanese women, guys. Yeah. That's... Dad. Yeah. How, how many more do we got? <laughs> oh, and I want more. I don't want to do this. I got one more. He really was a child soldier. Right. He's been uh, at war in fucking Easter pants and Crocs since he was seven years old. <laughs> Samir. <laughs> so it's painfully obvious that Samir is African. Little known fact, this is real, Samir is actually also Muslim. Uh, which is why every time he's bombing on stage, he uses the audience as human shields. <laughs> I don't want to do this. Well, well, well. Mike Knight. <laughs> one more, right? One more, right? I think this is it. This is the, this is the good one right here, all right? Brace yourself for this, all right? This is the good one right here. I like Mike Knight. He looks like my favorite rapper. He looks like Jay Quall. The J, if the J stood for, I'm a troll, I live under a rock. That's what he looks like. I thought that was a good one. I, thought, I really thought that was going to be the finishing touch. I will speak for everyone when I say, what the fuck was that? What did trolls no. ever do, Samir? <laughs> oh my God, everybody, give it up for Sudan versus the South Side of Chicago right here. Give it up for them. Give it up for Samir. This is really great. He's gonna get, he's gonna get extra credit in his English as a second language class. This is really great. Chris Greco. Oh man, that sucks that Samir came to this country and saw Kevin and was like, oh, that's how you dress? Uh, <laughs> what a bummer. For the record, he saw how I dress, okay? Well, he saw how I dress. Samir looks like he's still a child soldier. Oh. <laughs> That's kidding. All right, I shouldn't make fun of that. You look like Coney 2024. God. The whole time I thought you were going to ask him, why are you gay? Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. I will tell you, I mean, Samir, like, every time you had a joke that didn't work, everyone was like, uh, and then you would just go to your notes, you were like, all right. <laughs> <And it> <laughs> And it was just awesome. It was just, uh, that whole battle, guys, was fucking awesome to watch. Like, you were so likable, and you had so many great jokes. Um, the practice before a real black guy fucking rocked, dude. That was a great joke. I, obviously, I think Mike won by laughter, but great job. Thank you for doing the joke. That was great. All right, one for Mike, Katie Kincaid. Oh, man. Samir, you look like you'd call the cops on Mike. <laughs> <laughs> That's very true, actually. That's very true. I mean, Mike, Mike does look like the lesbian I'd be interested in, and Samir... <laughs> And Samir's the gay guy we'd bully. <laughs> uh, you also just look, look like uh, two black guys who are both into anime, but like in different ways. <laughs> I mean, this was so much fun. I, Samir, I got the, the real black guy roast was so good. Mike, uh, Mike, you were just like, you were literally roasting. <laughs> it was so fun to watch. It was also so fun to watch you have so much fun with it. And then I just, uh, even though some of yours tanked, I just, the more they tanked, the more I loved you. <laughs> You're so nice. Oh, uh, you guys are rock, uh, but I think in the end, I'm going to give it to Mike. All right, two for Mike, two for Mike, Gabriel Alviso. 
Yeah, I just want to know, do you guys also teach a class at Second City? Uh, we applied. Yeah? yeah. I, uh, my favorite part of the whole battle was when you made a joke and then you're like, African joke. <laughs> uh, yeah, Mike won. Yeah. All right, there we go. Kaylee Horton. Hello. I, I'm personally pissed off there weren't more racial slurs because I can't say those. And <laughs> I thought that would be fun. I... <laughs> Mike, you look like Samir's great-great-grandchild after they started integrating with the white folk. <laughs> so I'm in the house. <laughs> I, gotcha. It was so fun. I loved you guys. You're both hilarious. Uh, I'm going to give it to Mike, though. All right. Tim Smith. I mean, Mike won, but easily my favorite part of this whole, <laughs> the whole roast was then uh, Samir looks down at his notes and he goes, oh, this is a good one. <laughs> And then proceeds to tell the worst joke that's ever been told in Zany's Old Town history. <laughs> that rolled so much. You guys are really fun, though, but yeah, Mike won that one. All right, thanks for winning. Give it up for Samir as well. Make some noise for both of them. Hey, thanks for watching Roast Battle Chicago. If you guys want to subscribe to our channel, you get even more content, a bunch of it, hours of it for free. And you can hit that little like button down there, hit the subscribe right over here, and check out these videos right over here.